you will hang the bulk bag from the strap hangers on the top of the IBC. You will put the neck around the neck seal and inflate the neck seal to make a dust tight seal. Once the bag is hung in place properly, you will come to the scale and set it up for the weight you want in the bag. Set point one is where the gate is going to go from fully open to halfway closed. We are going to run a 2,500 pound bag. Set point one weight should be set at approximately 60 to 70 percent of what you want in the bag. So for a 2,500 pound bag, I would set set point one using the up and down arrow keys to 1,800 pounds. Get an eight, press the over, go down, get 1,800. You may press enter once the scale or the menu reads 1,800. Set point one is now set at 1,800. At 1,800 pounds, the knife gate is going to go from fully open to halfway closed and it will slow the product flow down. We are going to set a 2,500 pound bag, so set point two target weight should equal what you want in the bag plus the free fall that is going to happen after the knife gate closes all the way. At set point two, the knife gate will close all the way, the product flow will stop flowing, and you will have some product in midair until it reaches the scale inside the bag. So I normally set that at about 50 pounds under what I want in the bag. Set it to 2,450 pounds by using the up key and getting 2,450 pounds on the menu key, uh, reading. Once you have that, you may press enter. To double check your settings, you can press the set point one key, which reads 1,800 pounds. You press the set point two key, which reads 2,450 pounds. You are now ready to start the process. You would start the machine and the knife gate would fully open. The product would start coming in and as the product came in, the weight would go up. When you reached set point one, the knife gate would close halfway, slowing the product flow down. You would continue filling until you reach the 2450 pounds. The knife gate would close all the way and the free fall would fall into the bag and you should end up at 2500 pounds. Once you are there, you are ready to remove the bag. You would release the straps, deflate the neck seal, and take the bag out.